L'shana Tova. As the rabbi said, I'm Seth Frank. I'm the president of Shari Tefila. As the leader of the board of trustees and the executive committee, I'm excited to have you participate in our high holiday services. I'd like to also thank you for this opportunity to continue to lead our fabulous community as our president. As you see, we have a full house today. We are live streaming our services to our membership as well as an additional 100 guests. I don't know about you, but to me, with such a full house, this almost feels like a Taylor Swift concert. <laughs> yep, just like it, except without the Taylor Swift part and without the Tra Travis Kelsey part and without the crazy media part, and the Ticketmaster inflation part, and the traveling to a European city part, and the screaming Swifty fans. As you may notice, Cantor Kipna's songs are almost a copy of many of the songs on the Swifty tour. <laughs> but hey, other than that, I feel like we have the same vibe going today. My wife, Lori, and I, and our daughter joined TST over 25 years ago. Last year, I generated a lot of controversy about Duke basketball, and many of our UNC friends were none too happy with me. So I'm staying away from that kettle of fish completely this year. However, our daughter is here. She goes to Northwestern Kellogg, as a number of family members do. And there is no controversy with sports, since sports are not really their thing. <laughs> As you know, our TST value and mission is meaning, connection, and purpose. Meaning, TST looks to deepen the understanding of our Jewish values and our place in history. We continue to learn through dialogue and gain a better understanding of our complicated world. We do this through understanding of the meaning of our heritage, the value we place on learning as a culture and a community, whether in religious school, nursery school, or adult education, gives us meaning and the value we can add in today's complicated world. Purpose. TST aims to provide support and purpose throughout the many stages of our lives. TST allows us to mark the important moments, whether through blockbusters of bar and bas mitzvahs, weddings, baby namings, religious graduations, or finding sound counsel in life's more difficult moments. And through our deep connection across various religious and cultural groups, we gain purpose through understanding others' perspectives. Through mutual support, we demonstrate our belief for all justice, for all, and fairness. Connection. Our community is what truly sets us apart. Whether you've known us for just a few years or are relatively new members, we are known as a comforting place. Our warm, relatable clergy are the heart of our community. Many families begin here in the nursery school, planting seeds for lifelong relationships. We welcome the entire family to every service, starting with Tat Shabbat, inviting our children to always feel part of our service, instilling a connection to Shabbat and Judaism from a young age. We, encu we encourage intergenerational relationships. We bring in non-traditional speakers. We promote get-togethers with our sisterhood, men's club, and Shari Social Club. We offer connection to many facets of our lives because our people and staff know the value of a united community with a goal of deepening connection and comfort. While an integral part of who we are, these values do not come without the constant effort and devotion of our truly talented staff and leadership. 
There is no better time than the start of a new year to remind us all of those efforts and the leaders who make this institution what it is. That, of course, begins with our senior clergy leader, Rabbi Mosbacher, beginning his ninth year with us as senior rabbi, who supports our members when needed and works with outside organizations to tie TST to both New York City and the world issues of the day. Music, as I said earlier, with Taylor Swift, is our hallmark of our temple. Cantor Kipnis is his source. He does a great job with our choir, all musical support, and of course, as you may know, or many of you know, our young people throughout their formative years. This year, we welcome back as well, for a second year, Emily Levin as well on the cantorial team. We also want to thank Rabbi Rubin, who has shown great leadership in her first two years with us through new programs, working with our young families, as well as our valuable Shari Circles. We would not be successful without our tremendous work and tireless effort of our executive director, Amy Schwach. Amy is recognized as a leader in the United States as she is now the president of the National Association of Temple Administrators known as NADA. It's not NAFTA and it's not NATO and it's not, and we're not separating out of it. We are committed to NATA, NATA. We are lucky to have Amy and thank her and her entire staff who do a great job. We are also excited to have Sarah Beth Berman as our religious school leader. For those of you who participate at religious school, she has breathed new life into our crucial part of our community. And we are thrilled to see the success that we've had. This year, we have slightly under 200 students for enrollment that started a couple of weeks ago. We always want to shout out to our nursery school director, Sue Ulis. Our nursery school this year is oversubscribed. We actually had to turn away some families with children because of the size of the building, and we have the maximum amount of students that we can take into the nursery school. So thank you, Sue. These are just a few of the people that make TST what it is today and whose work will make it what it will be in the future. But it's really you who are our future. Your present today, as you can see by the full rooms, is a testament to your commitment to this community. But it is also an investment that you make in our joint future. We offer many programs that are part of your annual membership. Many of you take advantage of these, some of you do not. These include our adult education program, Chazak, which is a leadership program focused on leadership in the world, not necessarily only designed for religion. We have many Israeli initiatives to learn about our heritage. Our Shari Justice team is robust. Our Shari Social Club exists for us to meet and gain new existing members. And Tasty, which is a wonderful organization, is our, is our important teen program, as many of you know. So today, I'll challenge you a couple of times. The first one is, I challenge you to engage with us. Enjoy the breadth of what TST has to offer. And then, if there are things that you don't see, I'd like you to call me, call Amy, she's in the back, or call RM and ask for something that would be different that you're looking for. This year, we also baked into our membership costs our nursery school families. We look to these new members as the engine for our future. Thank you to our new nursery school members' families for this past year for their participation in what we call the Rainbow Appeal, which drove over 60% participation from our nursery school families. We thank you all and encourage you to participate even more to shape our community and future. I now turn to a more dire topic, as many presidents like myself will do today in every time zone 
pretty much across the entire globe. As you are all aware, it is a very difficult time in the world. There are many groups working to denigrate Jews, destroy the state of Israel, and the growth of anti-Semitism in America and in New York City continues to accelerate. I had the opportunity recently to have dinner with a few of the Israeli families who, ha who have families still as hostages in Gaza. It's a heart-wrenching story, one that is now past the one-year mark. The continued war in the Middle East, possibly getting bigger every day, makes this a very dire time. In the US in 2013, there were approximately 800 reporting cases of anti-Semitism. In the US in 2023, just 10 years later, there were 5,500 cases, a 600% increase. And it continues to grow every day exponentially. From Gaza, Hezbollah, Yemen, and Iran, to the radical views of many Palestinian supporters in the US, to the remaining Israeli hostages, to protests on college campuses, to the growth of hate in America. Every day there are new issues rising around Jews in America. And this is now the norm. Hate has become accepted more than ever. This heightened threats put more emphasis on the role of this community. We must be here to really listen to one another, provide sanctuary for one another, and support one another. As an example, TST continues to raise our security budget every year. For 2025, our security spend increased from 100,000 a few years ago to $400,000 today, or 5% of our total budget. Obviously very important that we're safe, but it costs a lot based on the world. The TST annual appeal as it is an investment in our future. I request today that we set our participation rate, which continues to grow every year, at 100%. For those of you keeping score at home, that means everyone in person and everyone watching on the screen. What is this investment for, you ask? Ah, my friends, it's an investment to stem the tide of hate, to allow all people to have the right to worship however they want anywhere in America. The annual appeal is a key part of our financial support for the services that you desire. The funds we gain go towards the crucial programs that enrich this community. With your support, we have many groups, including our recent programming on October 7th, our trips to Washington, supporting Israel, sending our rabbis to the Ukraine and to Israel to support our efforts. Our high schoolers are traveling to Argentina, our trips to Cuba and to the South to discuss and show our Jewish heritage. Social justice, reproductive rights, backpack buddies, free lunches for the homeless, and other active programs are all part of this caring commitment. All of these programs are here for you to engage, to learn, and to grow. And they are be here, be here because of your generosity. But as I said earlier, we can still improve. Last year's participation was approximately 60% is just a little more than half of our membership. The time, my friends, is today to participate with so much of the world on fire. For those of you who give already, please, re -give, please review your giving amount. Can you match it from last year? For those that can, are you able to increase your donation from prior years based on the state of the world today? And then, is it possible to upgrade your membership to enhanced? The enhanced membership includes special programs, speakers, seating, special opportunities. Call Hallie Golden or me anytime for more information. 
And as they say, operators are standing by. <laughs> For those of you that do not participate yet, please consider participating in this year's appeal. Many of you give to a range of charities, and we ask that you look to TST as part of that. Our objective is to grow with you and to ensure that our kids and all future generations can see a world of less hate. The board, the clergy, and I thank you for your previous generous contributions. And thank you to our enhanced members for con contributing above and beyond the normal dues. It does make a big difference for our community. I continue to be inspired by the strength of us, how we support one another, and how we participate at Shari Tefila. Maybe we are like a Taylor Swift concert, just different. I conclude with a mazel tov. Thank you for participating in our community, for being members, and for learning and growing with us. Thank you for making this place comfort and friendship. And thank you again for the honor and the responsibility of being the president of such a wonderful place. On behalf of the board, the executive committee, the clergy, my family, I wish you all, to your families, a sweet and healthy new year. Lishana Tovah.